watched you setting this up <laughs> the past few days wondering what it was. Unloading it over here. Right, 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 right. Uh, simply put, it's a piece of sculpture with paintings inside that uh, you go inside, sit down in if you care to, uh, and close the doors and have a private, uh, as somebody said passing by yesterday as I was setting up, oh, it's a, like a private uh, viewing space or private gallery. So this is inside out, outside in, it's sort of architectural, it's like a gallery. It's meant to be immediate yeah. and to be unexpected. Yeah. And 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 then it, it is ephemeral. I mean, it's, yeah, it, well, it's movable, isn't it? It's so marvelous the way it crosses the boundaries. Do you see? It's an integrated art form that speaks to all the kind of formal issues that we encounter in structure and territory because of the war. Uh, you know, I mean, it's it's when I it's first terrific. when I first Thank saw it, you. I thought it yes. was a, as in. Paris as sort of some New York no, piece was. But the other thing right, right. I mean, the, other, the other thing that's happening a lot in London is that they do this what they call pop up. So right. as opposed to doing miles of legislation yeah, you like just, Southwark where the elephant castle yeah. is, right. would say, yeah. right, we're redeveloping yeah. this site. You can have a triangle like that and put up a cafe, put up a theatre yeah, stage. Or two months or something. Have a pop up. Yeah. For right, three sure, right, sure. They, so so in a way this is an amazing pop up solidity and density and structural weight that is is a you know it's a paradigm of popping up but actually solidity New York of course has a rule for everything oh, yes. and uh, and in order to be here yes. uh, you have to conform to pages and pages that you can't even imagine yes. one of those uh, the key one is that you can only occupy eight feet by three feet by five feet high. Vertical walls have to be a foot from the ground. So you're basically looking at the embodiment of those codes and rules yeah. in architecture. Yes, yeah, fascinating. I mean, in a sense. You actually have to conform to these. Oh, it's so marvelous. Uh, the marvel of it is that um, it's a pop-up that you you don't need to ask anyone or. To to, to achieve, yeah, once you've settled You just need to it. look and see what, and, and then go from there. Yes, it's, it's, it's fantastic. His wife had seen me, maybe when I was at the Jewish Museum last spring, and, uh, and they stopped by, and the man was moved it by, he said, you don't know what you have here. Well, I've spent a lot of time with it. I like to think I have an idea of what it is. Yeah. But uh, I think what he meant was, uh, you think this, he did not say this, I'm putting words in his mouth, you think this is a work of art. Mm. This is something more than that. It, you have to feel it to, and of course works of art you have to feel too, but you're it's all comers here. I mean, yeah, I think that's right. I think it's a universal work of art. That's the thing. It touches lots of different elements and levels. You know, it's sensory, it's solid, it's confined, it's a you know, coffee shape, it's, you know, it's what, it's, there's lots of things. Thank but you. But as you say, it lets you out. It, it, you're not trapped in. You can use that space and configure. Yeah, it's it moves around. I've done it in various parts of town. On the Lower East Side and up here last and spring. The, did you have to pay the city for it? You don't, because it's within the size of the codes and rules that the city allows for vending stands, believe it or not. Yeah. And then there are all kinds of codes and rules as far as where it can be. And then, of course, you run into people who don't want it here regardless of the codes and rules. So. But no, as long as you're within those, you can... This is steel with an epoxy rubber coating on it. The paintings hang in these niches. And they're and they're and they're lit through the openings below. Well, eight at a time, and please watch your head. 
to was... you. It's a box. There are lots of boxes in the box. Okay. All different colored dots. The view from my prison window. Not much to see. How did you choose that name? Well, it seemed. Uh, I mean, it was what I was wanting to convey. I mean, basically, I was wanting to. Uh, I mean, it, I suppose it's an abstraction, but it's it's the imagine imagining a prison window and then imagining the view from it. You can see on the website all the places I've been. Okay, thank you. You're welcome. And there may be answers there to your question about the paintings as well. Okay. Thank you.